Hi everyone, this is part two showing when the woman gets the wings of the great eagle and the great earthquake happens on the west coast, which will actually be part of the wrath of the lamb when all of the armies rise up for World War III. This earthquake is supposed to happen, volcanoes going off and then creating tidal waves all around the world as nuclear events even begin to happen. And that is supposed to be the wrath of the lamb beginning and when the woman is granted the wings of the great eagle as we showed. The reason it's shown right here in California because it represents as we shown before Cali. And this area right here, the San Anof or excuse me, the Salton Sea area, which looks like a keyhole or a nuke, is right where the San Andreas fault line comes to. And then right here even to the San Onofre power plant area you can see right here mapped out this eagle ready to go when all of this these domes and the nuclear events and then the nuclear radiation poisoning and and the plagues all begin it is shown right here in this mural from the Bank of America you see the woman right here ready to give birth and there are the domes and then the fifth age with all of the the disease and everything coming and even martial, martial law and up here even a gateway opening or even a stone falling. See all this fire and these people? And all of the end times beginning when the woman gives birth. This is all by Bible scripture. That's it happening right there. San Clemente even means mercy. Well all of this is mapped out down here. We mapped these out several years ago. We have thousands of videos out so not many people can find all of them. So let's show some things. This one's actually mapped out just as this. There are more secrets the other way. God has everything done perfectly. All of the Baja Strip up to the Salton Sea area represents the sword coming out of Jesus Christ's mouth. Right there. Striking that area and creating the great earthquake of Revelation 12 for the eagle and the Ezekiel 38 war earthquake when everybody comes against the USA and Israel. There is the sword. This will all be mapped out. We have mapped out everything now, even with the, the bottoms of the oceans and everything, all of the ocean floors. Everything is done. And now you will even see mapped out right here. This is actually my picture on the, uh, this blue picture on my YouTube page. And it will actually map out all of us and the wings of the great eagle. Right here is part of the eagle granted to the woman just as the flight of the phoenix. Right there you can see Jesus and the woman ready to go. And then you can see all around them the phoenix as all of us go with him. This is all this is through a blaze of glory as all of this stuff goes on with the earthquake and everything right there. You can literally see that as that sword comes out of Jesus Christ's mouth and the great earthquake all happens and to the woman were granted the wings of a great eagle right there now you can see right up here the nuke that's coming that we shown will hit right down near here see the nukes coming the sword out of Jesus Christ's mouth the woman granted the wings of the great eagle all in play at the same time and we pass over the time of this red bull coming you can literally see the bull right there you can be skeptical or not it, it's all here for years now we've been showing this see how we're taking off there we go just as we've been showing we pass over the bull as that red bull of war comes just as we've been showing, which also represents the Torah and the time of Aaron and Moses all through these things. This represents the door out and then the foolish virgins are left behind through there. It's mapped out even all the way to here again, perfectly over here. This is probably one of the first things we showed a long time ago. See we are flying over. Now it's going to show that the whole USA is actually meant to go in this big event that's coming. You can see right here mapped out this lion's face. See the lion? Right there? It's actually going to show an arc. Now that you can see the arc. 
and it's in the shape of the whole USA. See that there? See the whole arc? It even lines out to the star systems with the Pleiades and passing over the Taurus to Bull and everything going by the star systems and going through Orion. And now you can see down here the individual again, the wings of the Great Eagle. He's standing right down here and this area actually here is called a sea of glass on the bottom and that represents the part where the angels are all standing on a sea of glass singing. And there's the angel. See the angel with his arms and the right arm. See how the, the lion is screaming out and now do you see the phoenix flying to the ark and everybody being lifted up and then it shows everybody being reborn right in here as a large child like it's a large crib. You see the child inside and then as we talked of before going through the star systems and even having to pass through the dog star Sirius. You see when you have this little dog it represents you have the Lamb of God with you and you can pass through the gates to get into heaven. And there we are as children all reborn being lifted up as we shown from Cali, exactly from California, right there, exactly as we've been showing, passing over the Red Bull and the Torah, which most people want to go face. This is the same picture I showed just yesterday. See, we go through this door. Now comes the Red Armies, and then comes the time of Aaron and Moses, or Michael and Aaron. See, all there, just like Michael Pence and Donald Trump. This right here even represents the guillotines coming, and then the wandering in the wilderness with the foolish virgins, and then all the way over here till Joshua gets the new staff. Remember, Moses and Aaron don't make it into the promised land, and they go through all the basic grant, great tribulation. We go in the door. It's the same thing. They want, they want the red bull. Remember, Moses and Aaron were about the golden calf and the red bull. Jesus gets us through the door passes us over that stuff. The same thing here. The same picture from the Denver International Airport. We go through this door with the earthquake and nukes and everything coming. If you're left alive, do you see now the gold with Donald Trump and the guillotines? And then comes the cube of Islam until the new tree. We pass over all of this through Jesus' door. The foolish are locked out with the Moses and Aaron types and go through the Great Tribulation and wander around in the desert and have to go to war. So there we are. That's exactly what we've been showing. All the way over until the Ark lifts off and everybody else around the world that is consumed in the tidal waves and earthquakes. That's if, however you're snatched away. <clears throat> Excuse me. But that represents all of that and us passing over the time of the golden calf and everything that's coming and war. Jesus passes us over all of this. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. This is even why Donald Trump was involved with Chris Christie and trying to block the bridge as they talked of. Because Donald Trump and Michael and everybody actually wants the people to go to the guillotines. It, it's part of it. Moses and Aaron want everybody to go into the desert and suffer. Jesus says we can go right through the door and we're already redeemed. We don't have to go to any guillotines. We don't have to go to the golden calf. See, he's on the golden calf right there. We don't have to go to any of that. We don't have to go suffer in the desert. We can go right to heaven. And then we are grafted into the tree on the top. And we're all finished. We got it all done. Then we can come up and down, as they say. And we've been grafted in. Children and heirs of Christ. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead. And you'll be saved. Hallelujah. Thank you very much, everybody. There we go. Let's show that one real quick one more time. You can see the whole boat right there. That's the boat. Even the little dog in there. See, so you get your little lamb. Sorry. There we go. Let's just show the angel right there.
Here we go. And you can see that I am is coming right up here. <coughs> see him coming down? And it says, I am. I am. There we go. God has paid our price. We don't have to go to any guillotines. Thank you very much, everybody. Hallelujah.